Hello my YouTube family. This is Diva Z Russell here with the haul. I have some things from Michaels, um, Old Navy, and TJ Maxx. Um, so first I'll start with my Michaels items. I purchased two of the photo boxes, memory boxes and the fuchsia and the like craft color um, I'm going to use these for organization in the craft room I may put photos in it I may put scrap paper or something in it but these are on sale five for ten dollars so I purchased two they co cost me two dollars each so I got the turquoise and craft paper one as well Okay, and this says these hold over 1,000 photos or 14 DVDs or 18 CDs. Two of those. I picked up another package of the Celebrated Basket Bags. This is the small size. Um, 13 inch by 17 and a half inch. I had to purchase a larger size one because the ones that I hauled last time didn't quite fit what I needed them for. So I'll try these. Okay. Out of the clearance area, I purchased this Heidi Swap uh, Ephemera. And there's 48 pieces in here. And this was on clearance for $1.29, regular price $3.99. I'm not sure what's all in here. Some different little ephemera. There's uh, numbers, hashtags, it says thank you, carefree. So all of those come in there. I uh, purchased um, this is sticky notes set. You get 160 pieces, and this is by Recollections. And this was on the 99 cent bin. And it's in black and trimmed in gold with some black lettering, um, some flags that say to do and noted and date. never fails there's the phone hold on just a second okay sorry about that I tell you every time I start filming a video the phone rings and it get just gets brought into the room where I'm at so here we go I also picked up one of these chisel tip glue pens by Ick Tools. I'm going to try that out. And it says it's repositionable and permanent. I picked up a package of the Recollections Butterfly Embellishments. They're pretty purple with glittery um, gold antennas. And really pretty. I thought I can use these on one of my craft products that I make my little princess mirrors that I will show one day. Um, so you get four pieces in a pack and I believe these were $4.99. I may have used my 40% off coupon on this one. I think that's really probably the highest priced item that I purchased. The other things were either on sale or clearance. I purchased a pack of the foam adhesives, the Recollections, Recollections foam adhesives. A little square so I can use them to like raise some things up. You get 70 squares in a package. 
I also purchased these Recollections Creative. They're the washi stickers. And I think these were these were on clearance for $1.99. And actually these were $1.99 as well. I said 99 cent, but they were $1.99, I believe. Um in the gold and black. I can use them next year if I do a like a New Year's theme in my uh, planner. Um, what else? I purchased this mug. It has my favorite color on there. They didn't have my initial. But this B stands for my husband's name is Brian or it can stand for my daughter that passed away um, at three years old. Her name is Brianna. So I picked it up because I have some B initials in my family. So this was in the clearance or let me see. No, this was it was regularly $4.99 and I believe this was 70% off. Right. And then the rest of the items I picked up were stickers. I just picked up one package of these Halloween um, dimensional stickers, the blue ones. And these were $3.99, but all the Halloween stickers were 30% off. But I only picked up one. I was really just looking around to see what they had because I seen that on the 25th, the washi tapes and I think stickers um, recollections will be uh, what were they hmm there's a percentage off of them I want to say 40% or 50% off the washi but anyway I, it was a good deal so I said I'll wait and go back on the 25th and pick up some washi tapes and stickers if they're on sale. I know the washi tape is for sure. I also picked up this paper chain garland. It's a Halloween print for $2.99 and I do think this was 30, no, 40% off. I should have brought my receipt with me down here because I would know what this things cost. But anyway, I purchased this so um, I can do this project with my daycare kitties. We can make um, these Halloween chains and decorate the daycare room. I think they'd like that. And then the other items are sticker books. The um, Createology. Um, I purchased this Boho Owls one. I thought that was really cute. And these are a dollar. This one you get 244 pieces. I hope you can see this. That one. With the little foxes and owls. And there's that one. Sorry if you hear that chain rattling. My ceiling fan in the dining room is gone. Okay. And I purchased the Give Thanks sticker book. One dollar. I don't think I picked this one up last time. But I thought it was cute.
the scarecrow and the little pet pilgrim girl, I think. Hmm. Yeah, and there's a pilgrim boy and some Indians. A fox and a turkey. Really cute. That one has some little apples. You can do a lot with these. You can use them in your planners. You can add them to your pocket letters. Put them on envelopes. A lot. Okay, and the last one I picked up was the Freaky Fountain. It's a Halloween book. And they had several different options to choose from, but I just picked up this one for now. Oh, I can't wait to go back to get some washi tape. So I was trying not to spend too much because that's what I want. Washi tape and stickers. Okay, so that's what I picked up at Michael's. Um, now we'll go with TJ Maxx. Okay, the first thing I picked up was this Whitmore six section stackable drawer organizer and it's the clear acrylic but when I get it was $4.99 but when I got it to the register I saw it had a crack right in the bottom there I don't know if you could see it but it was not a big deal but I just asked could they take anything off of it because it was cracked and they were able to bring it down to $3.50 which would have been the first clearance price they would have put on it. So I was like, yeah, I'll take it. I thought maybe I could use this for my washi tape or just the washi tape that I'm using, you know, at that time, like in that season, like I can put some Halloween and fall and then like some everyday washi tape that I like to use in there. I don't know. I'll see. But I knew I could use it in my craft area so I picked it up um I picked up these cute little gift bags now these are in the clearance section they're design focus and you get a set of two coordinating designs each bag is six and a half by seven and a half and it's the donut design isn't that cute and then the little gift tag is a donut as well. And there's the other one. On one side it has the raised donut. And on the other side it's just flat. And on this one there's some little glitter donut. Really cute. So $2 for that. I thought it was worth it. I also picked up, oh, I just found something else from Michaels. I had purchased these Halloween mini pins, and those were 30% off of the $2.99. Um, going to use those with my little altered mini notebooks. I thought those were cute. Okay. And I hope I'm done with Michaels. So also from TJ Maxx, I picked up, it's just a two-pack cotton bras by Laura Ashley for one of my girls. They're growing out of their bras already. They're only 10 years old, Lord help me. So we'll see who these fit. They are 34 large. So we'll see if they fit. These were, I don't know if I said it, $3.99. I also picked up a 
couple snacks while I was in there because I was hungry, but I didn't bring them over here. But I picked up some gluten free chips and some type of rice um, cake with like a maple glaze on it, but they are gluten free, um, low in sugar. So, nice little healthy snack trying to switch my girls over to eating more gluten-free and organic items I'm trying to help them with their weight get their weight under control because I'm dealing with that with myself and later I am going to do some videos and tell you more of my story um, because I have lost a considerable amount of weight and I want to tell you how I did it and what I'm doing and my struggles and challenges and all of that. So it's coming. It's coming. So that was it from TJ Maxx. So, also, oh, no, it wasn't. There's these um, Seaside Collections. They're the little glass, like, flat bottom stones that I want to use these to make magnets out of them and this is a nice amount and these are larger than the ones I think I got from Dollar Tree so I wanted to try them and these are these were on clearance for two dollars so I'll see what I can do with them um, if it doesn't work I can just put them in a vase or something <clears throat> so now I'm done with TJ Maxx Okay, at Old Navy, everything was clearance except for one item, and basically it was just some items for one of my daughters. Um, I picked up her a pair of these full-length leggings in extra large, just floral print. She has a pretty gray sweater with some sparkly, some sequins on the front, and I thought that that print would look good with this solid gray. So, and these were on sale this week for $6, and these are regularly $9.94. So, I just picked up one. I just had bought her a bunch of leggings from Walmart. So, I just picked one of those up. And then, this summer top, she can use it next year or wear it with a sweater. But this was $0.97. Cents. Like I said, I wasn't trying to spend any money today not much at all so this was 97 cents and it's in this pretty mint green color excuse the noise somebody's in the kitchen running water <laughs> oh, but that's okay we gonna get through this okay yes that was 97 cents and then I purchased a pair of shoes for her right now. I don't know if she'll like them, but I thought they were cute. They're this bright, like fluorescent orange shoe. And these are on clearance for $2.47. And they got the, the like tweed or what is it? Like twine toe and then around the size. I don't know. I think they'll be cute with the right outfit. So I'll see if she likes them. But for $2.49, $2.47, I thought I could do something with them. If she don't like them, somebody probably will. I also found her this cute pair of sandals. $2.97 was the clearance price on these. As you see, I love color. Um, and they're like a bright coral color. Let me see. I'm trying to show this a little better. But it kind of goes up. Ah. It's hard for me to show it. The strap goes up the ankle a little bit. Super cute. I also found these and these were two let me see three forty seven. Super cute, like a gladiator kind of. If I can learn how to hold the 
items in front of the camera but it's a leopard print it laces up the front goes up over the back of the heel and the ankle and it has a zip in the back that was a good deal I mean she may be able to get a couple wears out of them before it gets too cold here and one last pair are some little tennis shoes silver and they were 97 cents those actually would look cute with the leggings and the sweater thought those was cute and she's not a real big tennis shoe girl a little, she's a little diva she likes shoes with a little heel or striped strappy sandals and things but every now and then I can get her to put on something a little casual a little more casual so that is all that I purchased but I like I say Check out those clearances, especially right now, you know, when they're getting rid of all that summer stuff. I mean, most of it's pretty picked through now, but you can find a few few things. So I didn't do too bad. I think at Old Navy, I, I know I spent under 20. I think it was 17 something. And then at TJ Maxx, I spent $17.10. Michael's was the largest purchase, which was only still good for me it was only 40 48 so in all it was a good little little trip so thank you for tuning in um please remember to rate and subscribe if you haven't already um just want to thank all my new subscribers for subscribing and all the nice comments and feedback that you've been giving me so until next time have a blessed day bye